Nobody really knows how to throw a punch. Oh. Ready for round two? I cannot believe you. Get out of here. All right, I, I know you're upset with me for saving Luis and Fancy's life, but go, leave. Don't you understand what you've done, you fool? You will never have a chance with Luis if he marries Fancy. Who's the fool? Luis was on that plane. When you tried to kill Fancy, Luis would have died too. He made the wrong choice. And if I can't have Luis, no one will. What did I tell you when we first teamed up? No killing. Right, like I ever listened to you. You know, I knew you were a little off balance, but I didn't know you were absolutely nuts. I'm not gonna let you kill Louise. You can't stop me, Aunt Sheridan. Oh, yes, I can. And I will. I am not going to let anything happen to Louise because I will kill you first. I've totally lost your mind. I mean, I wanna be with Louise just as much as you do. I doubt that. I love Luis, and he loves me, and he loves our child. Our imaginary child? Well, if you kill him, he can't be with anyone. Hello? Aunt Sheridan, it's Fancy. Who is it, Fancy or Luis? Um, could you come up to the main house for a few minutes? Aunt Sheridan? Yes, Fancy. Come up to the main house? I'll be right there. Okay. Now what? I don't know. But I'm warning you. You leave Luis alone. I'll do what I want, Aunt Sheridan. Luis will never marry Fancy. I swear to that. Celebrate, so have some champagne. Oh, how pretty! Is it a celebration? In a way. I bet I know why. A little birdie told me that you two were engaged, and I have a present for you. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. How did you know we were engaged? Yeah, Sheridan was the first one we told him. That was just a second ago. Oh. <laughs> you caught me eavesdropping. I was passing by earlier while you were setting up the table, and I heard you. I am just thrilled for both of you. Uh, really? Of course. You're my sister, and whatever problems the three of us have, I really do want you to be happy. As a token of goodwill, I brought you a present. Oh, nice. <laughs> Sheridan. What is it, pretty? Let Fancy open it, Aunt Sheridan. She'll find out. Oh my God, it's ticking. It's a bomb. What? It's a bomb, Louise. A bomb? Sheridan, don't act crazy. Aunt Sheridan, what is wrong with you? Don't act innocent with me. It. Sheridan, what's gotten into you? You really think the pretty would give us a bomb? Yeah, Aunt Sheridan, what is wrong with you? I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. You put on a good act, but you're trying to kill Luis and Fancy. <sighs> don't look at me like I'm nuts. Pretty just tried to kill you. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, Sheridan, seems a little far-fetched. Aunt Sheridan, are you feeling all right? You'll see. You'll see. I'm right. <laughs> it's not ticking anymore. I defuse the bomb. The bomb. Obviously, I've made a fool of myself. So, all the best, Luis. Fancy. Congratulations on your engagement. Will you, Sheridan, come back. No, Sheridan, just let, just please. Just let her go, you... Louise. She's mortified. Well, she should be. It's so bizarre. Huh. What's gotten into her? Louise, you must know she's never gotten over you. And now she finds out you two are engaged? I mean, must have pushed her over the edge. 
Ugh, poor thing. She really does need some help. Once I agree with Pretty, Luis. Aunt Sheridan's behavior gets weirder by the day. Oh, come on. She just saved our lives. Oh? It's a long story. She is awfully tense. And you must know she still wants to reunite with you, Luis. It colors everything she does. She could use a good therapist. Well, you two are awfully hard on her. Uh, only because we care about her. Come on. It is an odd situation for all of us. But don't worry, I still have no intention of snagging Louise away from you. I'm glad. I just want to make sure that you are going to be a good father to our child. <laughs> you bet I will. You're acting awfully mature tonight. Fancy, I am going to be a mother now, and I had to grow up eventually. I just, I am worried about Aunt Sheridan, though. I mean, what if she hurts herself? We need to figure out a way to help her. God knows she needs it. Maybe you're right.